Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem. So here we have uh, 3 to the power of 11 minus 11 and now we need to simplify this algebraic expression. Okay, so here you see that uh, uh, the very first step we are going to do is here first we use the nice exponential law. You know about this law if we have a to the power of m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m times of a to the power of n so here according to uh, first we need this rule so uh, for using this rule we first break the exponent of this 3 and we write 11 as 10 plus 1 minus 11 and after this step uh, here we need this rule so according to this rule we break these exponents and it will be written as 3 to the power of 10 multiplied by 3 to the power of 1 minus 11 uh, and after that here we need to focus on this minus 11 and we write this minus 11 as in this way so we write this as minus 3 minus 8 we know that minus 3 minus 8 is equals to minus 11 okay so further you see here in both of these terms we have 3 be the common term so that now we take common 3 and the remaining terms are when you take common 3 from here the remaining term becomes 3 to the power of 10 minus when you take common this 3 and you get minus 1 and this is our minus 8 so further in the next step uh, we uh, again rewrite this expression as 3 times of we write this 3 to the power of 10 as 3 to the power of 5 and its whole square we know that 5 to the 10 minus we write this 1 as 1 square and minus 8 okay so uh, after that uh, here we need to use uh, a nice algebraic formula so you know about this formula if we have a square minus b square it is equals to a minus b times of a plus b okay so here we use this nice algebraic formula so that uh, according to this formula our above expression will be written as so you see that this is our a 3 to the power 5 is our a and 1 is our b so we uh, apply this formula on these terms and it will be written as 3 to the power of 5 square minus 1 square so it will be written as 3 to the power of 5 minus 1 into 3 to the power of 5 plus 1 and minus 8 okay so further uh, uh, further we uh, need uh, to uh, put the value of 3 to the power of 5 you know that 3 to the power of 5 means that we just multiply 3 with 3 on 5 times okay so when you multiply 3 with 3 on 5 times you get here 3 3 is a 9 9 3 is a 27 27 3 is a 81 and 81 3 is a 243 okay so this is the oral uh, multiplication you can do this multiplication in your head and now we replace uh, this 3 to the power of 5 uh, is equals to uh, 243 so this will be written as 243 minus 1 into 243 plus 1 minus 8 okay so after this step uh, we need to subtract these values so when you subtract 243 by 1 you get here 242 and here you get 244 minus 8 so in the next step here we need to break these two terms and so that uh, here we get those terms in which the multiplication will becomes here easy so we write this as 200 plus 42 and we write this term as 200 plus 44 and minus 8 okay so further uh, you see here we need here another nice uh, algebraic formula so here uh, i can in order to multiply these two factors here i can uh, use the nice formulas you i think so you already know about this formula if we have x plus a into x plus b 
if we need to multiply uh, this type of two factors then we apply this formula here first you multiply x with x you get x square and plus after that you see here the first same term is x and you add other two terms so you have x times of a plus b and plus you multiply the uh, other two different terms these two terms so a and b multiplied by a b okay so you see here this is our x on both of these terms and this is our a and this is our b so according to this nice formula we will write our uh, above product in this form so first we have 3 into 200 multiplied 200 becomes 200 square and plus here we have x so our x is 200 into a plus b a is 42 and b is 44 and plus a b so a is 42 multiplied by b is 44 okay so here we need uh, more simplifications and now uh, you do all of these simplifications in your head without using the calculator so uh, we in order to find the 200 square you just take the square of 2 we know that the square of 2 is 4 and you double these zeros there are two zeros and we can put here four zeros and plus here uh, when you add 42 plus 44 it is equals to 8 six and plus here this is the 42 multiplied by 44 i think so you will easily do this multiplication by traditional method of multiplication which you can learn in the primary classes okay so when you multiply 42 times of 44 you will get here 100 1848 and minus 8 so this is our minus a so we will put it here okay so this minus 8 will becomes here and after that here we need to multiply this 200 with 86 so it will be written as 3 times of 40,000 and plus here again you will multiply these two terms 200 by 86 then you get here 17,200 plus 1,848 minus 8 so uh, further we need uh, to add first add these uh, three values so now in uh, traditional addition method you easily add these three numbers i can just do these steps for you so you have this is a 40000 and this is 17200 this is 1848 so here you add all these values from this method you get here 8 4 8 plus 2 10 and we carry 1 1 plus 1 2 plus 7 9 and 4 plus 1 becomes 5 this is 59,000 and a 48 so here we need to multiply this number with 3 okay so when you multiply this by 3 you get here 3 8's uh, uh, 3 8's are 24 we write 4 carry 2 3 4 is a 12 12 plus 2 14 we write 4 and carry 1 3 0 is a 0 and 0 plus 1 becomes 1 3 9 is a 27 we write 7 and carry 2 3 5 is a 15 plus 2 becomes 17 okay so you get here uh, after multiplication with 3 you will get here uh, i can just write it here uh, uh, 177,144 minus 8 so you easily subtract this value with 8 then you get here our final answer will be 177,136 uh, sorry when you subtract this value by 8 you will get here 36 I will write it here 177 and 136 so this is the our final answer in this problem and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos